a rule of thumb is that if RPMs ever correct a hydraulic issue, that usually means that the hydraulic pump is weak. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to put a new pump in it. Not going to go through the uh, MCV itself. We are just swapping out a pump, so pretty uh, should be pretty uneventful. Of course, I am draining the oil. Took the clutch assist off. Took the uh, battery out because I had to get to the battery tray bolt so I could get the clutch assist bracket off. Currently uh, taking a break from. Taking the cooler lines off, those are fun. Ah, uh, the next, taking out, took out the top line there, then taking out all of these bolts except for seven of them, which are right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And we're gonna take that battery tray right out of there. Gonna match the O-ring up there with the new one. I'm also going to measure my gasket so I put in the right thickness of gasket. There's a 15 thousandths and a 20 thousandths gasket. This one is reading 19 thousandths, so I'm going to put a 20 in. And that shims this gear to the PTO driven gear.
I torque all these bolts to 25 foot-pounds.